Hey guys, and welcome back to another more with Moro's video. Today is going to be a first for not only myself, but for this channel. As you guys can tell from the title of this video, we are doing an Aldi's grocery haul. You guys, I have never shopped at Aldi's before. No reason why. I think the closest one to us is like 15, 20 minutes, so it's not too far, but I've just always either gone to Publix or Walmart, Harris Teeter, sometimes Target, just never went. I've had people tell me in my personal life and you guys as well, I need to go and check out Aldi's. So today, I was like, okay, looking a little bare in here. Well, actually it doesn't look that bare, but the kids were starting to complain like, we want this, we want that. Pantry was looking a little bare too. And I'm like, okay, today's the day. I need to get some grocery shopping done. Let's go ahead and try out Aldi. So I'm gonna be honest with you guys. Everything that you see right here was $230. I don't have the receipt. I don't think the Instacart lady left it. Um, I did have it delivered, so it was a little bit more because of that, but all of this food right here, all of this food, there's some right there, was a little over, kind of over, $200, which if I would have gotten all this food at Publix, and maybe even Walmart. Walmart's a little bit cheaper. This would have definitely been at least $300. So I'm really excited. I took some recommendations that I found online of stuff to get. You guys will have to also let me know down below what I should get at Aldi's. What is a must have that I need to buy? What do I need to try? I noticed that they change out things. Like they have their Aldi finds, I think. I saw something when I was on the app. Anyways, let me know down below what I need to get. Um, I also did want to say really quick, I did not get any meat because we are fully stocked on meat right now in the freezer. So a lot of this is snacks and produce and stuff to kind of go with dinner meals too. So let me not make this intro really long and go ahead and show you guys what I got. So starting over here, usually I have the produce over here. I put the snacks over here and all the produce is over here. But starting with the snacks, you guys you know my kids love their mini muffins. So I saw that Aldi has a chocolate chip one and they also have a blueberry one. And you can see it's already been open because Fletcher, as we were like putting everything out on the counter, he saw these and wanted a pack, so we gave him one of those. Um, but it comes with five and four in each. I think that's about the same that Little Bites has, but these were way, way cheaper than Little Bites. So I'm excited to see if the kids will like those because if I can just buy those, instead of having to buy so many Little Bites and spinning an arm and leg, I'll just get those from now on. Here he comes now. <laughs> what are you doing? Here he comes now. He loves to climb onto the stool, onto the counter, and see what's going on up here. What is it? Do you like the muffins? I see the crumbs all over your face. Oh, what are you grabbing now? You want some veggie straws too? So I did get a little box for Nolan of Cheez-Its just because he, he loves his Cheez-Its. And I've tried to find like alternatives. He is an avid Cheez-It snacker eater. He loves them. But I did see that they had these turtle bakes, kind of like goldfish, but shaped like turtles. So I got that for the kids' snacks and for lunches. But you guys know we love our 90 second rice just because it's, I mean, there's some nights and some recipes that I will go, I'll cook the rice on the stove, but there's those meals that we're just like trying to hurry and make quickly. These are our go-to. So I am excited to try this jasmine rice. And then we got some mac and cheese. That's always a staple, the shells and cheese and these mini alphabet cookies. These have 12 pouches, so that'll be like an easy on the go snack. And I also got some mini Bear Grams. Again, these are like little snack packs. And oh, I got two boxes of the shelled mac and cheese, a thing of lemonade. I'm actually gonna try to make the medicine ball tea at home. I already have the teas in here. Let me show you guys. Where is it? Right here. The Tivana. I think that's how you say it. This one is the Jade Citrus Mint, and then this one is the Peach Tranquility. So with these two, and then also lemonade, and it's steam lemonade, and also the honey. I don't think I'll steam this though. I'll just add it to it. But with also honey, which we needed to get some more of, um, you can make your own medicine ball tea at home. So I also got those. And then some bacon and some pepperoni. This is a big pack of pepperoni. My kids absolutely love pepperoni, especially when I pack their lunches and put some cheese and crackers in there or they'll just eat it by themselves. This is a way bigger bag than the little bag that I get from the store, this brand. And they're a thick slice too. And then I also got a carton of eggs. And then I saw that they had these flatbreads, this pepperoni and mozzarella cheese. I got one for Frank to try for lunch. 
So, and I might even try it as well because it looks, so, look how good that looks. Bakes fresh in nine to 11 minutes. And then of course I had to get Harlo her blueberry bagels. The only thing is they did not have regular cream cheese. So I got, I don't know where it is, but it's down there, salted caramel. I've never heard of salted caramel cream cheese. I don't know if she'll like it, but we're gonna give it a try because it actually sounded really good. I might even just eat it myself, but Blueberry bagels, some unsweetened applesauce squeeze pouches, comes with 12 in here. And then I only meant to order one of these. I always do this with at least one product. I'll accidentally get two or not get enough, but I ordered two of these protein bars and it comes with, I guess, 20 bar, oh no, four bars. Okay, I'm confused. But I saw that it had 20 grams of protein and only one gram of sugar, comes with four. And this flavor, coconut almond, sound good. So maybe the universe was telling me that I needed four boxes because I'm gonna really like it. So I got those and some potato chips, also some blueberries. And right here we have watermelon and pineapple. That pineapple looks so good and fresh. And the watermelons, I know it's at not in season right now, but it still looks really, really good. And also some moo tubes. So we got two boxes of the cotton candy and melon berry ones and it comes with eight tubes on the go so like i said two boxes of those and then i did want this maple sugar cereal it was like an oatmeal cereal but they were out of it so i just told her to replace it with this instant oatmeal just the maple and brown sugar flavor so i got that you guys saw a gallon of milk, a bag of spinach. I'm gonna try to make Nolan a fruit smoothie today. If you guys don't know, he is currently sick. He has the flu and he has not had much of an appetite. So I'm gonna try to get some nutrients and vitamins in him and make him a smoothie and try to sneak some veggies. I can't say it too loud. Sneak some veggies in there and see if he will at least drink that. Uh, I got some strawberries and then I have a whole bunch of canned stuff here. I think this is for chili this week. Looks like everything, yeah, all of this is for the chili. So we have diced tomatoes, kidney beans, tomato sauce, more diced tomatoes, and then I think I got some black beans. Yes, black beans for the chili. Um, so that is all for a dinner meal. And then I got a bag of these, they're called crunchy cheese. They look literally just like Cheetos. I almost wonder, you guys, and tell me if I'm right or tell me if I'm wrong, I feel like some of these products are probably the same exact thing as name brand products. It's just slapped with their logo. Am I right? Am I wrong? Some of this stuff looks exactly like the name brand. So you guys will have to sound off down below. I did get Aria a couple salads. They have these salads that you can put together and she really, really likes salads. So I got a chicken Caesar and a Santa Fe style with chicken. She likes to take these for lunch. And then I also got some great tomatoes. I think we're gonna do a pesto chicken meal again. We always make that meal, but it is so good. It's like one of our go-tos. So we always end up roasting some tomatoes. So I got a carton of those. Also a tub of vanilla yogurt. It's a organic whole milk yogurt. Um, of course, needed to get some pesto for the pesto chicken. I got these little smoked snack sticks for Aria. I know for sure she loves beef jerky and like little meat sticks like this. I don't know if the other kids do, but there's 14 in there, so they're welcome to have some if they want. Uh, some veggie straws, some cold brew coffee back here. So I was actually impressed because they have a lot of name brand stuff as well. Like you guys saw the Cheez-Its, um, they had this, they even had Betty Crocker. I got a bag of the chocolate chip cookie mix so oh and this brand too which i just realized i accidentally punctured so i'm gonna go ahead and eat this i don't want to waste it um, but the two good brand i love this brand it only has two grams of sugar so i got four of the vanilla and then also they had oh my gosh i forgot about this panera bread soup so I got two of their broccoli cheddar soup. So I was actually impressed. I was thinking that they don't have like popular brands, but they do, and it was cheaper. So that's a plus. And then here's that salted caramel cream cheese spread that I was talking about. This would actually be perfect for like some fall boards, like charcuterie boards. So I'm excited to see if Harlow will like that or not. Also got some raspberries. Oh, I did pick this up for the kids to try too. It's called Good Belly Probiotics. It's a pomegranate and blackberry juice, but it has 20 million probiotics per serving. So because it is, you know, flu season, RSV season, 
COVID season. Like there's so many things going around right now. I want to make sure that the kids are pumped full of vitamins and I know they're gonna get sick regardless. I mean, we've already been sick, but just to try to help them out a little bit. So I'm excited to see if they will like that juice or not. You guys can hear Fletcher upstairs. He's playing with Frank. Oh, did I accidentally order three? I think I ordered three, you guys. <laughs> um, good thing my kids really like mac and cheese, but I did not mean to order three of those. And then I did get myself some olive tapenade hummus. And I also got myself some of this cranberry almond chicken salad these looked really good i love i am a sucker for chicken salad tuna salad any kind of salad and i feel like this would be perfect with like some veggies like with even like celery or some crackers comes in four mini cups so they did have lunchables at aldi's but i saw they also have these little lunch kits too that were a little bit cheaper so i got smoked turkey and cheese lunch kit with these little chocolate there. So I got two of those and then also the ham and cheese lunch kit with like cookie dough bites it looks like. So I got two of those as well. And then underneath here is some cheese and cracker sticks. There's five of those. I also meant to get mandarin oranges but I think I forgot to add those in the cart because now I'm looking and I don't see them. So that was the one thing that I forgot to get. But I also got these mini potatoes. I figured this would be a good side for a dinner meal too. Just roast them up, like quarter them, salt and pepper, put them in the oven and roast them. I also got a bunch of bananas, pancakes. They didn't have the mini ones, so I got these regular size ones for the kids. I don't think they're gonna care either way. And then a huge bag, huge bag of grapes, green grapes a bag of lemons we've been making a lot of lemon water lately and putting it in tea and then two i didn't realize how big these were but i got two crowns of um broccoli like i said i didn't realize how big they were so we're gonna definitely have broccoli i might even freeze some oh and last but not least nolan's been wanting some i think they're called crunch berries i think that's the brand i think Captain Crunch, that's what it's called, Captain Crunch. These are literally just like it. It looks just like it. So I got those for him because he's been requesting that. Frank's currently getting Fletcher some turtle crackers right now, but I think I got everything. So right off the bat, I'm very impressed with all these. I am kicking myself now for not shopping there sooner. So we're definitely gonna see some more Aldi hauls. And like I said, definitely give me some recommendations down below of some things that you guys love from there and that I should try. Nolan just came downstairs. How you feeling, bud? Okay? Feeling okay? I got these for you to try. You want some? Or would you want a different kind of snack? I did get these. I did get some Cheez-Its because I know those are your favorite. I was gonna ask you if you could get bacon. Bacon? Cheez bacon cheese it's Okay, the next time we're at the store, we can get some more bacon cheese it's okay? Also, I forgot to show you guys this because Frank put it in here after he gave some to Fletcher, but I also got some orange juice. But that is going to be it for this Aldi haul. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. If you guys did, please give a thumbs up. Let me know if you guys want to see more, and I will see you guys in our next video. Bye, guys.